hey hey y'all welcome back welcome back so it is bright and early y'all and we are inside of dollar general getting ready to get into our five off of 25 haul video but if you're new to my channel i teach you how to save tons of money from couponing so you are in the right spot so definitely be sure to check out my five off of 25 scenario video where i have over 20 plus all digital deals that you can utilize for today only where we're going to be taking advantage of the five off of 25 digital coupon that you can find either on your dollar general app or sometimes you may find it on the bottom of your receipt but i like to keep things mostly just all digital so that way all you typically need is just your phone because you need to add the coupons to your account but when you head in here on saturday you're going to head to the register type in your phone number and then that's how all of your coupons come off and you're going to pay the total that i'm going to tell you plus tax so don't forget to like the video and don't forget to subscribe but y'all let's get into the video all right y'all so i actually came in here yesterday because i was in the area and just wanted to like kind of see like okay are they in stock and i went ahead and scanned these crest toothpaste right here now in the past they have been attaching to a three off of two digital coupon that i have on one of my accounts and i noticed that it was also attaching to the two dollar digital so like i always say y'all check different areas in your store they may not be located here, but typically the dollar hour is probably a great place to start. And like I told y'all before, look at this. Check everywhere. There's a ton underneath here. So picking up three of them is going to total you $3. But if you have both that three off of two Oral-B Crest Digital, and if you also have that separate just $2 digital, you're going to get $2 in overage alone. And remember, Dollar General can't physically give you that overage, so you would need to take that $2 in overage and maybe take that time to get something else you need. Or maybe you want to get two more dollar items, like some plates or something. But I'm going to factor it into my deal, so that way my out-of-pocket is even cheaper. But just keep that in mind. And then if you didn't want to do a full 5 off of 25, you could literally just come in here, get three of these. Again, you want to add in some filler items to help cover that $2 in overage, and you wouldn't pay anything but tax if you added something like exactly $2. And then if you're adding something that may be $4, maybe you have a dollar digital for it. Now that digital doesn't work for those like in the purple pack, but they are attaching to these right here. Let me show y'all the barcode. So I think I'm gonna do like two transactions today. Now remember also when you do use your digital coupons, they're gone. So of course you would need more than one account if you wanted to do more than one deal. But if you're using like a digital, five off of 25 and do you want to use a five off of 25 paper coupon you can use those on the same account but if you already planned on using those digitals they may be gone already unless you're using a different set of digitals so i'm at least pick up three of these but if i do more than one transaction i'm gonna pick up actually no on one of my accounts i have a three off of two and the two dollar digital and then on my other accounts i only have just the two dollar digital so i'm going to pick up three for one account and then one for another transaction all right, y'all. So if you haven't taken advantage of your gain digital coupon where you spend at least $20 and you get $5 off, you definitely want to spend, I mean, take advantage of it before it's gone. I believe it expires next week, but I'm going to go ahead and take advantage of it today because I have some really good digitals. So we all got $2 digitals that work for like the larger games, like I said in my scenarios video. So you could get like the liquid at $7.50. If you're like a gang flings person, you can get the gang flings. If you maybe need dryer sheets, you want to get the dryer sheets at $7.50. Or that same digital works for like those beads. But check your accounts because on some of my accounts, I got high value coupons for $2.50 off of like the dryer sheets, the beads, the fabric softener. And I have one for the liquid detergent. So I'm going to go ahead and pick up one of these liquid detergents at $7.50. Use the $2 digital. No, use the $2.50 digital. But again, if you only have the $2 digital, then you would pay 50 cents more. And then I'm going to pick up one of the game fabric softeners at $7.50 because I have a separate $2.50 digital. But again, if maybe you have a $2.50 digital for the dryer sheets, you may want to factor that in instead. So I'm going to go ahead and grab this. Now, I'm only at $15. I'm not quite at $20, so I need to get to at least $20, so that way I can get an additional $5 off for spending at least $20 in game products. So I am going to 
come over here and grab one of these game scented Febreze small spaces. And they're actually priced at $325. I'm doing more than one transaction, which is why I'm picking up two. But they're picked, I mean, they're $325, and we have that $2.30 digital coupon, y'all. And it's also attaching to that five off of 20 game. So definitely a great filler item if you still have that digital coupon. So I'm going to go ahead and get this added next. So now I'm about $2 short. I would like to add some of the game dish liquid at a dollar, but they are all out. Um, because I feel like those are great items to add. But a lot of times you can find the, um, the $2 dryer sheets. Or sometimes your store may have the dollar dryer sheet. So I'm just going to add in a $2 dryer sheet. And then on one of my accounts, I actually have a dollar twenty-five cent digital for like the game fabric softener that's priced at four fifty. So I'm gonna go ahead and grab one of those. And then I also may add because it's still gonna be cheap for me, but I think for one of my scenarios, instead of adding like a two dollar gain item, because you don't have to be. I mean, you want to be right at twenty dollars, but if you get over it, that's okay. So I think for one of my transactions i may end up adding this game power blast at 450 y'all comment below if you've ever tried it um but i think because i do want to get stocked up on some more dish um detergent that i may add it in but we'll see so i'm just going to factor it in and then i'll show y'all different ways you can cater the deal to your need all right so now that i'm about at 20 dollars worth of game products and i did also want to mention too since i'm passing it we do have a $3 digital for like that big boy gain at $15.95. And maybe you wanted to factor that in instead. But I think it ends up coming out to be a little cheaper if you actually, well, I guess it would depend on the digitals you have. But yeah, so always just cater it to your need. All right, y'all. And now that I'm at about $20 worth of game products, I want to now get to at least $25. So that way I can get that additional $5 off for having my total to $25 with that five off of 25 digital coupon. Or again, you can use the paper version. So we have a $3 digital for like the Frito-Lay, when you buy like the Frito-Lay product and like the drink, like the Pepsi product. So I'm gonna go ahead and pick up this ginger ale cause it is attaching to this, but if maybe you want the actual Pepsi, you can pick that up. There's other ones you can pick from, but I'm gonna pick this up because we actually drink ginger ale and this price at $1.25. But I do need to go ahead and pick up the chip. So hopefully they have the, I think it's called gold, gold ring, gold something pretzels. Um, hopefully they have them online. It said they were priced at like $3.35. So hopefully they have those in stock. Yes. So I'm going to go ahead and pick up these right here. Priced at $3.35. And with me picking up this and that drink hold on let me show y'all so let me picking these two up together these two total me 460 so i'll be able to use that three dollar coupon for buying the chip and the drink and that'll bring me down to just 160 y'all which alone is already great but remember we're factoring this into our five off of 25 so it's going to be even cheaper now say you did have those digitals for the crest that's giving overage this could be a great item to pick up because again, you end up paying like $1.60, but with that overage, that would cover it. And it may go towards some of the tax as well. So if you just wanted to do a quick little snack deal, that definitely may be something that you may want to test out and see. Or if you only have one digital for like the Crest, that's at least giving a dollar overage. So you would just end up paying 60 cents if you did it like this. Like if you have that $2 digital, you can pick up this. Now, if you, of course, you can get more expensive ones. I think like the Lay's are like three sixty if you want to pay a couple cents more. But I know my kids love pretzels, so I'm going to go grab that. But if you did it like this, y'all, you would end up because remember this is going to give us a dollar and overage. This is a dollar. We have that two dollar digital, and then this ends up being a dollar sixty. So that dollar overage will cover it, and you just pay sixty cents or a little more if you get like one of the more expensive ones. Now I did want to show you, this is an amazing deal to do if you do have these particular coupons. So you would want to pick up the Gain Liquid Detergent or the Flings at $7.50, clip the $2.50 digital. But again, if you use the $2 digital, just know your out-of-pocket will be 50 cents more. Pick up the Gain Fabric Softener at $7.50, use that $2.50 digital. Or again, if maybe you have the $2.50 digital for the dryer sheets, 
or those beads you may want to factor that in instead and then pick up the game fabric softener at 450 i have a dollar 25 cent digital and then pick up the game set for breeze small spaces at 325 and i have a two dollar and 30 cent digital and then i picked up three of those one dollar crest two paste i plan on using a two dollar digital but if you have that three off of two digital as well just know your out of pocket would be three dollars cheaper so this would total me 25.75 but after my five off of 25 digital coupon comes off and then that five off of 20 game dollar general digital comes off and all of those other digital coupons that i already mentioned come off y'all at the register i would pay just five dollars and 20 cents before tax and again if you happen to have that three off of two digital for the other two chris you would pay just two dollars and 20 cents y'all now you don't have to add in you could really take away those two dollar crests since we don't since i don't technically have a digital for it and i could just add in something for two dollars that i really really need so just keep that in mind but i think i may do my breakdown just a little bit different so this is how i'm going to do the deal so i can cater it to my need but again cater it to your need switch how switch your deal around based off the coupons you have or what your store has in stock so just to tell you how I'm going to do mine, I actually am going to pick up the game Liquid at $7.50, use a $2.50 digital. Pick up the game Fabric Softener at $7.50, use another $2.50 digital. Pick up any game item for $2, whether that's you picking up these $2 dryer sheets like me, or maybe adding in two of those $1 dish soaps. And then I added in the Dollar Crest Scope. I'm going to use a $2 digital. I added in the game scented for Breeze Small Spaces at $3.25. I'm going to use a $2.50, no, $2.30 in, uh, $2 digital. And then I picked up the pretzels at $3.35 and the ginger ale at $1.25. And with me buying both of those together, I could use that $3 Dollar General Digital coupon. So for me, this is going to total me $25.85. But after my 5 off of $25 digital comes off, and my five off of 25 digital comes off. I mean, my five off of 20 gain digital comes off, y'all. And all those other digitals that I mentioned come off. I should pay just $3.55 before tax, y'all. And y'all know the pretzels alone were $3.55, $3.35. Or the gain products together total you set $15. They're $7.50 each. So I'm able to get what I need and laundry care and then like i said y'all sometimes i may resell things in my stockpile so this cost me three dollars and 55 cents before tax and i was able to get items i need and this is for me using all digital coupons y'all again that you can find in your dollar general app so i'm teaching you how to save tons of money y'all and a lot of times i'm using digital coupons at that so let's head to the register and check out and see how this first transaction goes now y'all something funny is happening when i'm scanning this because i like to do one little final scan before i head to the register that three dollar digital we have for like the frito-lay and pepsi is attaching to this so because it's a dollar general coupon and you can combine that with a manufacturer coupon which is that two dollar and thirty cent digital that's a manufacturer coupon is this in digital form i shouldn't have an issue but i'm still probably just going to have the cashier ring up the food products first but I just thought that that was pretty interesting how that $3 coupon is attaching to this. All right, y'all went ahead and checked out with my first transaction and I want to show y'all the receipt. Sorry, okay, there we go. So there's the pretzels at 335. There's the ginger ale at 125. Now you're gonna see store discounts underneath each item because that's how you add up and get the five off of 25. Or if it's like a store coupon, like how we use the $3 coupon for the pretzels and the ginger ale it's also going to come underneath as a store discount but if you add it up we should get three dollars and then we also should get five dollars for our five off of 25 and our five off of 20 gain so just keep that in mind so um and then there's the gain at 750 i think that's the liquid you see the two dollar and fifty cent digital came off there's the gain fabric softener at 750 the two dollar and fifty cent digital came off and again, you see two store discounts. One is for the five off of 20, and then one is for the five off of 25. If we added all those up, we would get $5 twice. And then there is the Crest at a dollar. The $2 digital came off. There's the $2 dryer sheets. There's the Febreze small spaces at 325. And then there's the $2.30 digital. And y'all, my total was $3.55 before tax like I planned. 
y'all i saved a total of 22 dollars, y'all and i was gonna i needed the pretzels anyway and like i said we drink ginger ale y'all know sometimes i resell my items in my stockpile so this is not only just three dollars and 55 cents but this is gonna make me money so this is what i'm saying y'all you can use digital coupons and still come out great because i'm so cheap i don't even like paying for the paper i like to just use what the stores give me so i paid under four dollars for all these items and again these are the big the bigger games so y'all now let's see what second transaction i'm gonna do but an amazing time to get stocked up on household essentials and again there's different ways you can do the deal always cater it to your needs all right y'all and then for my next transaction this is what i plan on doing now on this account my digitals are a little differently but again always cater it to your need so i picked up the game liquid detergent at 750 i'm gonna use a two dollar digital that everybody should have and then i picked up the game fabric softener at 750 because i have a two dollar and fifty cent digital and again if you have another two dollar and fifty cent digital you may want to grab that item whether it's the dryer sheets or like the firework beads or maybe you have a two dollar and fifty cent digital for the game liquid maybe you can pick up two of those and again, if maybe you want the flings, you can get the flings instead of the liquid detergent. And then I picked up the Game Pow Bass at $4.50. I don't have any coupons for that. So if you wanted to, you really could just pick up any game product. Maybe you want to add in like one of the other game products at $4.50, whether it's like the dryer sheets or the firework beads. Because again, I don't have any coupons for that. So you could just add in any game item, but just get at least $4.50 worth. And then I picked up the game Small Spaces at three twenty-five. I'm gonna use a $2.30 digital. And then I picked up three of the Crest Dollar toothpaste. And I'm gonna use a $2 digital for one. And then a three off of two digital that's attaching to the other two. So that already is gonna give me $2 in overage, which is gonna help go towards my out of pocket. So again, if maybe you didn't have that, you could definitely factor in other items. You, the goal is just to be at at least $25 so you can get that additional $5 off. But this totals me $25.75, y'all. So I'll be able to use that 5 off of 25 digital coupon. So once that comes off, along with my 5 off of 20 gain digital coupon, and then all of my other digital coupons come off, y'all, at the register, I should pay just $3.95 before tax, y'all. Now, again, there's several other ways I could do the deal. Now, if, because on, on this account, I do have another $2.50 digital. I think it's for like the dryer sheet. So I technically could come out 50 cents cheaper if I didn't want to get the liquid. And because I have that $2 digital coupon clipped, I'm going to have the cashier scan the liquid detergent first because I want that $2 digital to attach to that. Because say I had the cashier scan the fabric softener first, that $2 digital may attach to that. And then that doesn't leave that $2.50 gain fabric softener digital to attach to anything else so i would end up missing out on two dollars and fifty cents so just keep that in mind i know i say this all the time things happen even sometimes i still get to the register and forget the whole thing i just said so i'm gonna try to remember to scan the liquid first but you can't beat that y'all three dollars and 95 cents for all these items and i really want to test out that gain power blast so again there's tons of ways you can do the deal i was only about like two dollars short of twenty dollars so you could again just add in the dry sheets but i just wanted to add in that power blast y'all i actually think i'm gonna change my breakdown around well hopefully if these are priced at a dollar i think i am let me scan these real quick but let me just tell you about the deal so like i say y'all always cater it to your need if i know i'm gonna buy this anyway it's probably best to factor it to my five off of 25 especially since we're getting that over it from the crest but the power i believe is a dollar but we have a digital coupon for when you buy four you pretty much get one free so essentially you get like four for the for like three dollars but it should still end up coming roughly about the same so let me kind of show you how i'm gonna do the deal instead all right, y'all, so I'm gonna switch my breakdown just a little bit. It's actually gonna cost me about 50 cents more, but at least I'm getting things I actually need. Now, although I did wanna try that game power wash, I'm sure I'm gonna be able to get it and try it couponing. So the only difference is I took out the game power wash and I added in the $2 game dryer sheets because the game products I have totaled me $20.25. But with that power wash, I was at like $22. So I was all well over $20. And then I added in four of the dollar power rays they are ringing up for a dollar when i scan them on the app and i have a coupon for when i buy four i'm going to save a dollar so it's like buying four but getting one free so this is now going to total me 27.25 and it's really that much because i added in the crest 
because it's giving overage. So this is 27.25, but after my five off of 25 digital comes off, my five off of 20 digital for the game comes off and all of my other coupons. So the $2.30 for the small spaces, $2 for the game liquid, $2.50 for the game fabric softener, dollar for the power aid, three off of two for two of the crests, and then the $2 digital for the last crest. I should pay just $4.45, y'all, before tax. So again, about 50 cents more than the previous transaction, but I'm okay with that considering I'm getting something I was gonna pay for anyway. So a great way that you can switch your deal around, but if you wanted to do it the other way around, you would pay $3.95. But this way around, if you're looking at it, even though it is $4.45, I am kind of getting more items in the way. So let's head to the register and check out. And on the way to Family Dollar, we go. All right, y'all, went ahead and checked out with my last transaction. Let me show y'all the receipt. So there's the gain liquid detergent at $7.50. And you see the $2.00. Um, digital so that two dollar digital did attach to that because i had to cash your skin there first there's the febreze small spaces 325 the two dollar and 30 cent digital there's the game dryer sheets at two dollars no digital for that there's all of my crests at a dollar each my three off of two digital came off and the two dollar digital came off just fine there's the game fabric softener at 750 the two dollar and 50 cent digital came off there's all four of my power aids at a dollar each and my um uh, you will see it as a discount for the dollar because that was a dollar general coupon and then my total was 445 y'all just like i planned before tax 445 so i still was able to get items i need for really really cheap and keep in mind if i was just to come in here alone and grab the power aid i would have paid four dollars and i was able to walk away with again the bigger tide i mean the bigger game products toothpaste small spaces and items i really really need so between both transactions y'all today this last transaction was 445 and then this one was what 355 so i paid roughly under or about eight dollars y'all for everything and one of the games is 750 by itself so again remember when you're using digital coupons you can only use them once so you would need more than one account but thanks for watching, y'all. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and I will see you all next time. And if you are into Family Dollar, I am heading there next. So definitely check out my Family Dollar video because they do have a 5 off of 25 just like Dollar General. But don't forget to like and subscribe, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.